Ready to learn STEM buddies? Let's go! Hey there, STEM buddies! Do you know what a solar eclipse is? If you don't, let's find out together! The sun is 400 times bigger than the moon, but it is also 400 times farther away. That's why they appear the same size in our sky. Astronomers can predict eclipses because the moon always follows the same orbit around the Earth. When the moon does eclipse the sun, it makes two types of shadows. The smaller one called the umbra and the larger one called the penumbra. There are four types of solar eclipses. First is the total eclipse. Here the moon fully covers the sun. This is seen under the umbral shadow or the path of totality. Next is a partial eclipse. Here, the moon passes over the sun but doesn't fully cover it. An annular eclipse is where the moon passes directly in front of the sun but is too small to cover it. The last is a hybrid eclipse which can create a combination of different eclipses. A type of solar eclipse happens at least somewhere on Earth yearly. STEM buddies always wear eclipse safety glasses when looking at eclipses so you don't hurt your eyes. You can only take it off during totality. Totality usually lasts for about three minutes. Fun fact, during eclipses, birds stop chirping and crickets start chirping and plants may scrunch up. Guess what, STEM buddies? A total solar eclipse will take place on Monday, April 8, 2024 in North America. And it will be called the Great North American Eclipse. Hope you enjoy it.